Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. I hope you're all doing really well. Before we get into today's video, I just want to start by saying a huge thank you so much. We've actually hit 100,000 subscribers on this channel, which is absolutely crazy and mind blowing. And I'm so, so grateful to every one of you who watches these videos and supports my channel. It's so appreciated. And yeah, I'm so excited to bring lots more content over here. I'm really enjoying filming YouTubes at the moment and hopefully you guys are enjoying seeing them and so yeah really excited to see where we can take this and really really appreciate your support so thank you today's video is going to be a little bit of a different one i was actually away this weekend just gone on my first ever brand trip which was with new look we actually headed out to mykonos for two nights and three full busy days and we were actually shooting some campaign footage for new look website and their kind of social channels and also getting our own kind of content out there as well um, but yeah, I didn't actually take that much content over here. I really wanted to share some of the outfits that I wore in Mykonos because I'm sure some of you have holidays and things booked and you're looking for some summer outfit inspiration. And um, so yeah, I thought I would do a little roundup of the outfits that I took with me. And um, I did do a little bit of kind of vlog footage while I was out there, but I'm not sure how much I got. So if possible, I am going to try and incorporate some of the vlog footage alongside me kind of talking you through the outfits and showing you them in detail um, and hopefully it's not too disjointed and um, but yeah that is the plan for today's video as always i leave everything linked in the box down below with all the size details and things and if i have missed anything then just drop me a message and i will get back to you and um, but yeah just gonna get straight into it today and i really hope you enjoy it as I just mentioned, it was my first ever brand trip, which I was so excited about and so grateful to have been invited. And it just felt like the perfect match for it to be with a brand that I really, truly love. All of the outfits that I'm gonna be showing you today are from New Look. These are the outfits that I wore on the trip. And yeah, I was a little bit unsure of what to expect because it was my first brand trip. But honestly, the whole experience from start to finish was just such fun and an amazing experience. And I'm so glad I went. It was with the loveliest bunch of girls. We literally just met at the airport before the trip for the first time and just instantly hit it off. Genuinely, it just felt like a girl's holiday with a little bit of work in there as well. When we first arrived, we were in this incredible villa. If I've got any footage of the villa, I will insert it so you can see, but it was absolutely incredible. It had like an infinity pool overlooking at the sea and I had this incredible balcony, which I shared with Nyla. And yeah, it was just unbelievable. I genuinely couldn't believe my eyes and was totally speechless. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to top this for holiday accommodation in the rest of my life but I'm so glad that I got to experience it so yeah when we first arrived at the villa we were all just taking it in unpacking and kind of settling into our rooms and things look at the little newspaper honestly like I actually feel a little bit overwhelmed this is just so amazing little newspaper welcome to our girls trip Emma this basket bag look at that so gorgeous the water bottle Amazing, loads of little bits in there. Hi! Of course you can! Just doing a little room tour. <laughs> Here's the girls. I'm just about to show the balcony how unreal. I just, I can't get over it. Oh, we can show Yeah, yeah, show them with Nora. Wow, this I know, this is absolutely insane. Then we had this unbelievable lunch cooked for us at the villa. The villa actually had a private chef, which was just insane. And um, the food was incredible. And then yeah, after lunch, we headed back to our rooms to shower and get ready for the evening. Headed for dinner at Zuma restaurant, which was just the most unbelievable dinner setting. The view of the sunset was incredible. The food service was amazing. So yeah, I would definitely recommend if you are heading to Mykonos this summer. So for the first night, because it was at this amazing kind of sunset restaurant, I wanted to go for something that was a little bit more kind of colorful and sunset vibes and um, so I decided on this green midi skirt which I absolutely love how gorgeous is this color and um, I wanted to keep things really simple on the top so I actually just paired with a white bodysuit and um, I was debating whether to go for like a really simple white crop top and um, I actually went for the bodysuit in the end which I really liked it was just a really simple kind of halter neck tie detail and yeah I thought it looked really nice with the green skirt 
skirt. Um, the heels that I paired with were also from New Look. They are public desire, but you can get them on the New Look website. And yeah, just a really simple strappy pair of white heels. Such a summer staple for evenings out. I loved them. They were actually so comfy as well. After the dinner, we headed back to the villa and we were just having a bit of a dance with music and drink. I actually kept my shoes on dancing the whole night and no one could believe it. But yeah, they were really, really comfy heels. So definitely recommend those. I just finished the look with a little white handbag. It actually fits so much in there such a good little handbag i loved the top handle detail on it and um, so yeah this was my look for night one and i just thought it was perfect for a sunset cocktail and dinner then for day two the itinerary was actually pretty chilled we had breakfast at 9 50 and honestly the breakfast was one of my favorite parts of the whole trip it was insane again it was cooked by a private chef at the villa and there was literally just every breakfast food you can imagine i literally had four courses every day and i have no regrets um, so yeah, we headed down for breakfast. Um, you didn't have to be like fully ready for breakfast. So I just headed down in a bikini with a cover up. And um, my go-to for wearing to breakfast was this gorgeous crochet knit dress. I just put a really simple white bikini underneath. And yeah, I absolutely loved it. It was my kind of go-to comfy dress of the trip. And um, it's really, really good quality, thick knit material. And um, so yeah, definitely one of my favorite items from the whole trip. I love this dress. Um, I picked this up in a size S and yeah, it's just a really comfortable, nice, flattering fit. Then after breakfast, we were actually heading to Mykonos Old Town to shoot some content around Little Venice. If you haven't been to Mykonos before, it's absolutely beautiful. It's really gorgeous, kind of cobbled little alleyways with all like white buildings, blue skies. So my outfit for day two exploring Mykonos Town was actually this gorgeous Thai strap black midi dress. I just thought this was the perfect kind of comfy, easy to wear outfit for doing a bit of exploring on holiday. I didn't feel too hot and yeah, I just thought it was a really timeless classic style. You could keep this in your wardrobe for years and bring it out every single summer, perfect for holidays or at home in the UK. I just paired it with some really simple flat black sandals. These were also from New Look. And yeah, I just thought it was a really kind of pretty, simple, but comfortable outfit for exploring Mykonos town. I really loved it and felt really confident in it. I actually paired it with a straw hat, which had like a black ribbon on it. And I also paired it with a straw bag from New Look as well. So yeah, that was my outfit for exploring Mykonos town. We got some really gorgeous content there. So yeah, I love this dress. I will definitely be reaching for it so much during the summer in the UK too. And um, I actually picked it up in a size UK six and it's just the perfect kind of floaty flattering fit. So then after we'd done some exploring Mykonos town and getting some content for New Look website, we were actually heading to a beach club. We went to Para J in Mykonos, which I've never been before, but the service again, it was incredible. The food was amazing and it was just a really gorgeous chilled beach setting. And um, we're actually getting some swimwear content again for New Look here. And um, the bikini that I wore on this day is this gorgeous kind of black and silver zebra print bikini. It's got this really subtle kind of glittery effect to it which I really liked it was kind of giving me rat and boa vibes so yeah I really liked it and the bikini bottoms were just a really simple high-waisted style really good coverage and I just finished the look off with a black sarong skirt and um, I'll try and insert some photos and things so that you can see the final look and um, yeah I really loved this bikini on the beach we got some amazing campaign shots as a big group I wore a size UK 8 and I think it comes as a matching set so I assume the bottoms are a size 8 as well well and um, yeah loved it then for night two we headed back from the beach club and had quite a quick turnaround because we were having a private dining experience at the villa again with the private chef which was just unbelievable i genuinely could not believe my eyes they set up the table so beautifully and our villa had the most incredible view of the sunset it was one of the highlights of my trip i just thought it was unbelievable for night two i actually had two outfit options which looking back i'm not actually sure that i went for the right one and um, so option one the one that i didn't go for was this gorgeous kind of mini pleated satin dress i think this is absolutely gorgeous and yeah looking back i'm thinking this probably would have been better for a sunset meal at the villa i think this would be gorgeous in the sun a golden hour and um, i picked up a size i want to say yeah size six in this dress and i'm five foot seven for reference and i just thought the length and fit was perfect and yeah i'm kind of regretting not going for this dress it does also come in green as well 
well. One of the girls had the same dress on in green on the first night and she looked absolutely stunning. And um, so yeah, such a gorgeous, fun, floaty holiday dress and I'm definitely gonna take this on my next trip so I can wear it then. The dress that I did actually go for is gorgeous. It's just this really simple cut out midi black dress. I feel like on holidays you just sometimes cannot beat a simple black dress. And as soon as I put this dress on, I just felt really confident and my best. So I decided to go for this one. And I just paired it with some really simple black strappy heels. These were kind of like a kitten heel height. So again, really, really comfortable. And yeah, just a really nice minimal style for summer. And again, it just finished off with the same bag as night one, that really cute mini white one. And yeah, just a really simple effortless look for holiday. Felt super confident in it and it got so many compliments. So yeah, I really love this dress from New Look. Really affordable, but it's super elegant and timeless as well. Then for day three, day three was quite a busy day. This was the day that we were heading home in the evening. Um, so in the morning, again, we had breakfast. I wore the same knit crochet dress that I showed you earlier. And then in the late morning, kind of afternoon, we were heading out on some open top cars to shoot some content again. And um, for this outfit, I wanted to go for something a little bit more kind of casual and fun. And um, so I actually went for this denim mini cargo skirt, which I absolutely love. Um, me and Nishi were getting content together and she was wearing the maxi version of this denim skirt, which I think I have shown you on this channel before. I have both and I love them both so much. So we were having a little bit of a denim moment. I'll try and insert a photo so you can see what I mean. But I love both of these skirts. You just cannot go wrong with a denim skirt from New Look. Um, and on top, I actually paired it with this really cute kind of puff sleeve tie blouse um, just for a really cute kind of casual daytime look. I just finished the look off with a black belt, which was also from New Look and a little straw crossbody bag two again i'll leave everything linked down below but i just thought this was such a cute kind of daytime exploring outfit i'm not gonna lie the open top car experience did stress me out slightly i was just so grateful that i wasn't having it to drive our villa was basically at the bottom of a pretty much vertical slope and yeah the guys had to literally get basically a go-kart up this vertical hill in first gear. Me and Nella were literally fearing for our lives in the back of this car. Um, but yeah, we made it. Shannon pulled us through and we got up the hill, got the shot, got the content. And then we headed back to the villa for some final content just around the villa in the swimwear again. For this look, I actually went for a crochet dress. I actually have this crochet dress in the black and the cream. I absolutely love it. Again, it's a really kind of good quality knit material and just such a staple for holidays. I get so much wear out of this kind of dress. Um, I picked these both up in a size small and yeah, just a really lovely flattering fit. It's so easy to throw on over a bikini or a swimsuit and a pair with some sandals and a bag. So yeah, that was the final outfit for just shooting some content around the villa in our beachwear and swimwear. And I got changed into my traveling outfit, which was just a really simple kind of comfy travel outfit. I went for some black cycling shorts and a little black crop top. And I just finished off the look with a really oversized linen shirt and some trainers and I actually used a new look tote bag as like my airport bag it was so big it fits so much in I actually really loved that bag and um, I will leave that link down below it's a really good kind of structured canvas tote bag so yeah that was my final outfit of the trip which is so sad I feel like even just kind of running through the outfits during this video it was over so quickly and yeah now I'm so sad at that it's over but I'm so grateful that it happened I'm so glad that I went on the trip it's one of the best experiences of my life and um, funnily enough I was actually gonna turn down the opportunity when I first heard of it and um, just because I was so nervous to fly from Gatwick with people that I don't really know and um, if you followed me for a while you'll know that I am quite scared of flying and um, but yeah I'm so proud of myself for pushing through and going on the trip and I absolutely loved it and just so grateful to you guys for your support because I never forget that this kind of thing wouldn't be possible without your support so thank you so much and thank you so much to the new look team for an amazing experience and yeah i really hope you enjoyed this video i really hope you loved the outfit i really loved them i felt so confident in all of them and yeah i will definitely be taking them on trips in the future and but yeah thank you so much for watching guys i really hope you enjoyed this video and i hope to see you in my next one bye guys